I recently challenged my friend Small into a lockout race, which gives you 25 random objectives scattered around Breath of the Wild, and whoever completes the first 13 wins the race. Unfortunately, it didn't go so well. So I asked him if he's up for a rematch, and this is what happened. I hope you enjoy. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Three, two, one, go. Good luck. Uh, Kill a guardian skywalker, activate 10 towers, any spicy meal, any spicy meal, any spicy meal. That can be very fast to get, actually. I should probably do that. Okay, okay. Uh, what is, are there any really easy stuff? Any spicy meal? Any moblin equipment item? Uh, are there any moblins on the plateau? I don't think so. Discover two shrines, activate climbing boots. Uh, open two bokoblin camp chests. That's actually pretty easy as well. So let's start with two bokoblin camp chests. Maybe a spicy meal on the way. Uh, let's run over and grab pepper super quickly. Oh! There it is. How did you get that done so fast? I've been trying to kill these freaking Bokos, bro. Any Boko equipment item. Wait, doesn't Boko Spear count? Would Boko Spear count? There we go. That's a better weapon. Got any Boko item? Wait, where? Oh, yeah, look at that. I did not even notice. Open two Bokoblin <laughs> camp chests. Yep. Really? That fast? Yeah, there's, there's a bunch on the plateau. Crap. Okay, that's fine. Wait, any Moblin equipment item? Crap, I'm trying to think what is what's considered a moblin again. A moblin club, I think is good. I think I think this guy has a moblin club here. Oh sh Damn it. Let me get it. Moblin club. Whew! Barbarian helmet. Oh, but it's plus two. By the way, so you agree, when it's a plus next to armor, that's like having to be upgraded, correct? Yeah, yeah, you have to upgrade if it has a star beside it. Oh yeah, stone talus is a good idea. I should kill a stone talus. There's a weak stone talus here. No! Damn it, I forgot about the talus one. If so, I should have killed the one at the Great Plateau. That would have been easier. About seven different creatures. We're up to one right now. Kill a talus of any kind. I don't have a hammer. I wish I did. So we're just going to grab food here so we have unlimited food for the run. This is a Ridgeland shrine that I'm going to. As you can see, I kind of need to shave right now. And you know what's got me covered? Manscaped. Thank you so much, Manscaped, for sponsoring my video. You know, Manscaped has hooked me up with a lot of amazing products over the years. One of which is the Perfect Package 4.0, which comes with amazing products like the Ball Toner, the Ball Deodorant, and my personal favorite, the Lawnmower 4.0, which is a waterproof trimmer. It has this nice LED light, and it's really easy to just kind of shave. It has this nice guard, so hey, look, I'm just doing it directly against my skin. No cuts whatsoever. It's an amazing product. And they have tons of other amazing products on their website, like the Plo 2.0, which is a single blade razor. They have amazing underwear they recently launched, which I definitely recommend to check out. So if any of that sounds interesting to you and you want to get a little bit of a discount, then be sure to check out manscaped.com slash link is seven or use promo code link is seven to get 20% off your first order and free shipping. That's right. So what are you waiting for? Do it. Click the button. I wish I would have thought about this sooner. I have I really don't have the equipment for this. Oh, I should have gone for the one on the Great Plateau. Or I should have gotten a sledgehammer. Oh, this is bad. Okay. Oh my god, I should have thought about picking up more weapons before trying to kill that. That took forever with an axe. Holy I crap. I didn't I had no <laughs> idea where the closest Talus was. I was like, that's an easy one, but I just don't know where they are. <laughs> da, 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 da. So that's one shrine done in, in Ridgeland. All right, this is our second uh, Ridgeland shrine. Now that we know he was doing the Stone Talus, he hasn't made any progress with Koroks or anything. Uh, activating seven, eight, and nine towers is on this board. I don't want to do that, but it is three goals. Of course, it starts raining. Okay, I'm trying to think right now. Okay, so let me actually look here. Oh, wait, one is activate. What? Hold on. Activate seven towers, eight towers, nine towers, and ten towers. Oh my god, I didn't look at that. Oh my god. He is so already doing that. Oh, I should have thought about that sooner. Okay, I think I'm gonna BLSS all the towers because normally it's a bad idea, but because I would get literally one, two, three, four goals from that one, I think I'm doing it. Okay, I already have two towers since the Great Plateau Tower should count as one since I since 10 towers is all of them, so it has to mean that the Great Plateau Tower counts. Knowing then uh, what counts as Ridgeland, the shrine here should also count as Ridgeland, meaning that I should be able to get my first one out of three here. This literally has to count as Ridgeland. Okay, that's three Ridgeline shri shrines. Let's do it. Oh. 
I don't really care if it counts as Ridgeland anymore. I'm gonna be honest. No particular reason for saying that. I just really... I just don't really feel like it matters. You know what I mean, Chad? Okay, now there is a 12 shrine total, which means we're only five shrines away from that now. So, what could we do? Are we close to anything else? Activating 10... T Wait, there's 7, 8, 9, and 10 towers? The f... What? Should I just be speedrunning towers, bro? Oh, come on. I literally need one health and a quarter, and he dealt two health, meaning I just barely couldn't do it. Oh, I, I can't afford these time losses, man. I'm just going quickly. Go! No! <laughs> Are you serious? I failed the- I failed the BIL! I'm so mad. Pog, tower number three. And this tower is one of the high ones, so we'll be able to get to the rest of the towers from here really easily. Okay, here we go. So we'll be able to get a hot spring right now, and it's only two, right? Okay. So we're gonna go do that, uh, and then we'll go to another area. It's gonna be a little bit chilly, but fortunately, uh, they are hot springs. I hate this game! Uh, this would be tower four, right? Okay, so this is- this is- this should be number five, and I already have a lineup for tower six and seven. I need probably, like, three minutes at least. So I just have to hope that he's also not going for it. Uh, it is literally right up there. It's right there. That's where the, the first hot spring is. Here's hot spring number one, and then directly east- Now we'll be able to heal here, and directly east from this is the next hot spring. Okay, that's five- two more towers, chat. Two more towers. Okay, that's six. That's six towers. I need one more tower. Here's another hot spring right here. Once we see the name, there we go. That's two secret hot springs. Uh, uh, some nice hot springs I've found. They're nice and warm, man. Damn. So what are you doing now? You said you were you were gonna go for uh, the upgrades. I'm just getting to the fairy found. I'm trying to plan a little bit more in advance. I'm trying to like, mm -hmm. for example, like if I collect Koroks in one area, like does it help for other objectives or stuff like that? I was not paying attention. Oh my God, where am I going? Shouldn't there be a tower here? Okay, oh my God, it just wasn't loaded. I was like looking around. I was like, where's the freaking tower? It took so long to load. No, I actually pressed my jump button. I need to find some form of food. It can actually be any food whatsoever in the world. I literally need a quarter of a heart. Oh. All right. I just have to climb this tower and he, without him finishing this quest, then I'm fine. No. Dude, why did I have to fall down during that BLSS? Oh, oh my God. I just have to press the A prompt and I can immediately click on it. Come on. So we can just glide into the tower. And this is tower number five then, right? Yes? Give me a yay or nay whether it's tower five or not. I don't want to miscount. Okay. Oh, okay. Towers? Dang. Oh my god. I, during, when I was gonna mute during our call, I was flying to the last one. I accidentally released my sprint button and oh, I no. just like fell down and I had to like climb the entire way. So I've been stuck for like three minutes. <laughs> Man, yeah, that's oh. that's really rough. Okay, we have to sprint for the next one. Because if he was going for towers, I gotta be fast. Because you can catch up easily on tower 8, 9, 10. After this tower, I think I need to get no food. I think I need to get food to get the other ones. Because, like, the other ones are higher up. Meaning I will have to BIL to get around. Oh my god. Uh. Um... Uh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I saw. I at first I was like, I'm not gonna go for towers. Except I don't even remember, but that's what I did last time. Yeah, I know. I was hoping you yeah. weren't. I have five towers. <laughs> oh really? Okay. Yep. I'm having a rough time, chat. I'll be honest. I'm gonna be honest. I think every tower I have left now is at a higher location. Uh, I think the closest one in terms of height is that one, but that one requires cold. Also, maybe I'm overthinking this, but he openly admitted that he had five towers. I don't know why, but I don't believe him. I'm going to still try and rush tower nine and ten, because until at least I have tower at nine, I'm not going to be calm. Okay, I'm going to boomy zoomy off his dead body. Oh my 
god. Okay, that was sick. That was sick. That was cool. Uh, we want to get the Guardian Skywatcher now, but I really cannot afford to to boomy zoomy. So we're gonna have to just wiggle the hell out of this. I think I'm gonna head for the stable instead of the tower because there should be some food around the stable, like peppers and stuff. I think. And it's a shrine in case I die, and it will cost an auto save. Because I already know that, like, with the food I have right now, since I have zero food and the health I have right now, there physically is no chance that I can uh, get the tower in the state that I'm at. How much damage does this do? Guardian Skywatcher's dead. Good. Now, what the hell are we doing? Actually, though, what the hell are we doing? I don't know. <laughs> uh, we could mount creature. You know what? Let's start doing some shrines. There was a cooking pot on the other side. Was I stupid? No, there is no cooking pot here. Chat, you're just, no. Oh my god, there's a cooking pot. Really? I'm still cold? Crap. This is gonna be so tight, because I'm gonna take one more bit of damage. Oh god, I don't know if I'm gonna get this in time. <laughs> Please tell me that autosave went through. I saw the save prompt. Please tell me that autosave saved me on the cliff. Yes! Oh my god, saved. By loading the autosave, I didn't get healed. If he snipes me on tower 9 now, I'm gonna be so mad. He better have given up on it. Yes, thank god. A freezing rod side quest. Oh, it's just that the oh, it's just the one in the Kowark Forest where he wants the ice rod. I could actually get that easily with my towers. Get out of the cold area. Get out of the cold area, please. Cold area stops. Cold area stop. No, it was changing. The auto save failed after a tower. I have to get it again. All right, I'm gonna have to be really fast and hopefully get out of the cold area before it's too late. But I don't know if I'll be able to do it in time. It's cold here. Bullshit! I have to drop down. I have to get food somewhere. Ooh, animals. No! No, the choo-choos! Lomay Labyrinth Island, you get the hat. It's not hard, but it just, it just sucks to get to, dude. How do you upgrade the barbarian helmet? First upgrade is one Lionel horn. So you need to kill a Lionel as well? Wait, that's all you need to do is to kill a Lionel? All right, uh, let's see now. Okay, now I actually need to start planning what I want to do next. So let's start planning here, shall we? I can get the ice rod pretty easily. That's a side quest that I can get that shouldn't be too bad. I should also be able to catch up slightly if I try and do some other stuff. Okay, ice rod is something I can definitely do. Uh, there's your 10th tower. Man, you're going to be able to be so behind now that I've almost finished everything else. <laughs> you really took your time on those, huh? Yeah, the last couple of towers took a while, so you've definitely been set up for a lot of stuff, I'm assuming. Okay, this is the problem. There's 20 Koroks, 12 Elden Koroks, and 5 Gold Ring Koroks. That's three in a row that he probably could get. I'm guessing he has gone for that. My guess is that he was going for the Koroks. I know where, like, some Koroks are, but not rings. We'll pick up this core. Um, I'm gonna need some Guardian parts to upgrade all the runes, because we're 100% gonna have to do that. That's one ring race Korok. Finish the shrine. I guess it there I do have 12 shrines. That's true. But he already got some though. He's probably already going for many of them. And he doesn't have to know locations like he does with Koroks. I feel like going for shrines is a bad take. I think I'm not gonna go for shrines. I feel like shrines, because here's the thing. I have an advantage with the Koroks, because I know Koroks better than Smant. He will know shrines, because he used to run hundred uh, all shrines. Also, Basically, 99% of the shrines can be skipped with a single BIL, meaning that it doesn't require individual knowledge to know how to skip a shrine. Good. Clean. 12 shrines. Yeah, I was talking about that. I was like, I think shrines is a bad play because he used to run all shrines. He knows shrines really well. So, mm -hmm. oh, by the way, there's another ring Korok uh, here. How many Koroks we at then? We'll check. I think we're at like five, which is nowhere close to the 20 we need, but... We'll do those if we finish them. Great. If we don't, whatever. But after this, we're gonna warp to the plateau tower. We're gonna get a. We're gonna wiggle bomb to a ice wizard robe. We're gonna grab the freezing rod. We're gonna do freezing rod. We're gonna upgrade all runes and we're gonna grab climbing gear. Okay, <clears throat> that's two ring Koroks. Let's pick up a normal Korok. All right, three. Okay. 
Swearing Korok. Okay, five. Uh, over here is also where the wizard is with the ice rod, which is what I need for a side quest coming up now. Unfortunately, I don't have any fire arrows, which uh, is very sad. Sucks a lot. Sad? Okay, that's the ice rod. I feel like I'm actually play playing this really well. I feel like I'm planning this out really, really well in my head right now. This was bringing me to the start of the woods. Can you get to the end of the woods just by boomy zooming to it? Is that a thing? No, I just need to find the quest. I don't know where the quest is, though. Man, I haven't finished uh, anything in a while there, huh? Well, I got the five gold ring, Koroks. Oh, dang it. I, I, I was like, that is so easy, but I just don't know where the hell any of them are. I yeah. was looking at that, and I was like, I wish I knew where more were. I wish I had finished the Hondo route. I don't remember the the strat for doing the bless thing. You know what? I'm going to do the old school strat, the one that uses a uh, backflip BIL. And that also means if I'm going to go for the old school strat anyways, I might as well drop down here to pick up this Korok here. You Kula? I don't... It just says, talk to Kula. Like, bro, not helpful. I don't know who the hell Kula is. I think that's just, this is the angle. I hope so. God, it's been so long since I had to do this. All right, we got the Master Sword. So that's a weapon we can use for a while. We need to go find Kula now. Kula at the top. Is that where Kula is? God damn it. I don't know where Kula is. Please tell me that's correct. Oh, thank God. Can I ride this guy? Okay, I got a stag. Uh, we need to mount seven different creatures. So I might as well mount that while I'm here. Kula! The sword is waiting. I have the sword to start the quest you need the goddamn master sword but like you have to actually finish the quest i literally can't do the freezing rod side quest now i'll do it oh my god oh my god never mind i have to equip it holy crap no i am not kidding i am in the quark forest with my ice rod literally talking to him in five <laughs> seconds i am so bad it's a mess oh well played on that one well played Wait, you have to watch the Master Sword cutscene? You can't do Master Sword early? Oh, if so, I wasn't as close as I thought. Okay, I feel a little bit better about that. Okay, I'm just gonna go in Koroks then. I should be able to get uh, 20 Koroks really quickly here. The four cooking cocoa side quests? That's a pain in the butt, because I don't remember... I don't remember the recipes. I don't want to do that. <laughs> wait, actually, wait. We are allowed to Google and use external links. Actually, it wouldn't be that bad now when I'm thinking about it. It wouldn't be that bad at all. And I also have so many towers. Actually, getting there would be really quick. We're at Tatino. Let's go to the blue flame now. Uh, it's like this direction-ish. Um, so now we can warp here. We're going to go get some climbing gear. And we got to get some rush rooms along the way. Uh, the gear is not hard to get. Uh, upgrading it is a bit of a pain in the ass. That's why I haven't done that. I, that's why I haven't done the those things yet. I'm going to go dueling peaks. But just because I want to get two Koroks ASAP. Because I don't trust the 20 Korok goal. So I'm going to prioritize that before I try and go for Coco then. Okay, that's the 20 Koroks. Dang, speeding these Koroks. Wait, how many more do you need to win? Uh, it's 9 to 7, and how many is it on the board? 25, right? So, yeah, thir 13. I will tell yeah, 13, you which okay. Still got a good amount to go. Yeah, lots to do. Goat, butter, swift, carrot, honey, raw meat. Crap, did I eat my raw meat? Damn it. Okay, well, raw meat is not too difficult to get, thankfully. Yeah, this is just three key swing and three rush rooms. Uh, because we're gonna get the bi another barbarian piece, and then we're gonna try upgrading. And this is taking a risk, because I could upgrade them right now. But we need to not risk that. While we're at the North Shrine, we're going to kill two flying guardians. And we're going to hope to God that they give us two ancient cores. That's what we need. We need two ancient cores. Okay, I need to go and get honey. I know where I can get honey, but I, I can't think. I don't want to get, like, I don't want to get too backseated. So I'm going to go for where I know it is. And the closest one I know where it is is not close by. So I have to warp away and pick it up. Either way, okay. So, and while I'm doing that, I should also kill an animal so that I can get some meat. Notice me. Cowards. Cowards! I need your parts. Um, those ones have the highest chance to give me uh, ancient cores, and I need ancient cores, and we only have two shots at this. Oh. That one didn't die. Okay, all the parts will fall down here, I guess. Ancient gear. Uh, we have all the springs we need. We do not have all the cores we need, and I used all my ancient arrows. I'll try killing one more, I guess. Uh, with the bomb arrows that I have. 
But we still need to kill the uh the Lionel to get the horn. Honey, 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 honey. I swear one of these trees have honey. Do they not, please? I swear there should be honey in this woods. It's further up. Crap. I was going the right way. I just canceled my BIL too early. This is slow. And then th I know that this you pick up honey in early game and the new Hundo route. So Span definitely would know where that is. I swear there's honey on this tree. I swear there should be honey on this tree. Okay, I was gonna say, bro, I'm not that stupid. Oh, there's a fox there. That 100% counts. Okay, I just have to cook two foods now and I'm good. Okay, I have one more. Okay. Whew. Dude, I could not find the honey for the life of me. I had such a hard time to find the honey. I had, I had no idea where any of those quests even were, so I kind of just gave up on that one. Oh. I was like, you can have that. I had no <laughs> idea. Yeah, now is when it's starting to get harder, in my opinion. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, there's a lot of things that are difficult to do. Bottle is badly damaged. I need to get on his back. I need to get on his back, dude. Does Mount Lionel count? Yeah, it does. I just need to shoot him in the face once, bro. There we go. There we go. So that's two. Good. Just, I really should not have chosen this one to kill. Okay. Finally. There we go. Give me, at least now he needs to give me a horn. We got a good bow as well and a bunch of arrows. I need wheat, tabantha wheat, and cane sugar. Isn't there a shop that sells those things? I then need three different kinds of food. Wait, I'm actually a little bit Monka W. It's three different kinds of fruits, but I don't think pepper counts as a fruit in this game. So I think I can get wild berries and apples, but then I need to get one more. And the speedrun I usually use melons, but melons would be a very slow one for me to get. I could get bananas, but there's no close by bananas. Let me double check. Is it two or three fruits? Oh, as many as three different fruits. Do you think two would count? Okay, uh, we need to get three key swings and then we can upgrade the climbing gear and the barbarian helm at the same time. Or the climbing boots and the barbarian helm. Got the autosave. Okay, let me try. Apple, wild berry, cane sugar, wheat. Nice, fruitcake worked. You got that one too? Yeah, I, 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 since I had the oh towers Lord. unlocked, I was discussing, I was like, wait, in the oh, Hundo run, yes. I know that we don't pick up the sugar and the wheat, so there's a store that sells it. And then there's wild berries next to the tower, and it's just two fruits and then those, so. Uh, okay, huh. All right, we have everything we need to upgrade the armor, so we're gonna go in, we're gonna pay the money, we have the money, we're gonna upgrade the armor, we're gonna upgrade the climbing gear. We might need to do the Divine Beast main quest. I know that he has the climbing gear stuff, so I think what I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna go for 12 Elden Koroks because I can get a potion so I don't get killed in that area. And then maybe I should just do a Divine and Beast? Question mark? Because that one, I feel like he probably wouldn't be going for. The beast is so slow. Yes, but I want to play in a way that's clever where I can't get locked out by Smanth. If I start going for a barbarian one and then he snipes me on those, which I know he already has, uh, unless he lied to me, actually, that is true. He could lie to me, but either way, no matter what, he has a high, a high chance of getting that. Okay, let's count together, chat. So this is one. There's one. Holy crap, you got both at the same time? Yeah. Damn, I guess, oh, is it similar items to use to upgrade them? No, they're completely different. I took a huge risk. Really? Okay. Because I'm going to say, I... I mean, yeah, we don't upgrade those in the speedrun since it's not permanent one. So, mm -hmm. yeah, I just, I was not going to try it. I was like, I don't want to Google it and no. try and <laughs> figure out what items I need. Oh, GG. Damn. Okay, 9-11. This is a bit spooky now. I'm scared what he might go for next now. Uh, was that three, Chad? One, two, three. Yeah, okay. Three, four... Five, six, seven, eight. Directly west from this tower, there should be a shrine that has an ancient core in it. It's a medium test of strength, I think. Uh, it doesn't say minor test of strength. We should be able to finish it off pretty easy with our Lionel equipment. So we'll just kill it with the Lionel equipment, run past, grab the ancient core, not even finish the shrine, and then we'll go upgrade all of our stuff. And then we'll be, I think, tied up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, tied up. I really wonder what you're going for. Because if you're not going for what I'm going for, then, I don't know, it might be in your... This whole thing might be in your favor. 
Yeah, you'll, you'll see. I'm planning some stuff. I'm trying to outsmart you, but I'm hopefully not, like, overthinking things. So we'll see, I guess. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to start by upgrading the runes. We're going to upgrade the runes, and then, I mean, we have to go for the Mount Seven Creatures and Divine Beast main quest. Was that 9 or 10? That was 9? Okay. Okay, I have some good news and I got some bad news. The good news is that we're about to get our 10th one. The bad news is that the last two is a little bit more tedious. So if he actually is super close to getting this, I'm going to be a bit in a rough spot. Okay, 10. 11. 12. There we go. Okay. Yeah, this takes so long to upgrade all runes, bro. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, he needs one more. Oh, my God. He's going to go do a Divine Beast. Which means I need to do it first. I need to do a Divine Beast before him. We'll warp back here later. Okay, if he has started the Divine Beast, I'm going to be a bit screwed. I don't know if that's what he meant. If he thought he might go for a Divine Beast, I'm going to do one instead before him. I could be a little bit screwed. Because if I start this one, he has an advantage on climbing gear, upgrade all runes. The only one he wouldn't have an advantage on is mount seven different creatures. Unless he's been going for that behind my back, but I don't know if he would have done that. I'm scared. You, wait, are you at 12? Uh, yeah, I'm at 12. <laughs> so you need one goal to win? Yep. Oh, uh, huh. Wh wh which one are you going for by chance so I can, s so I can snipe you on it? <laughs> I guess you'll find out eventually. Which one are you going for? You know, so I don't accidentally get sniped. <laughs> Honestly, I was doing one of them and then I changed my mind once I saw you did that and you were at 12. So I really hope I, the one that I was doing, you weren't, you're, you're not planning to do right now. Going for this one is honestly a very, very big and bad gamba, possibly. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm, I've gotten my <laughs> head now that I, I feel like what I was doing, you are now doing. I mean, I was doing something that I thought you, you you might do, and now I think I'm doing something that you might do because you didn't think I was gonna do it. But you know, I'm I'm in my head. This is this is tough. It does say one divine and beast main quest. So actually, when I read that wording, it does mean yeah. it means that I can't just beat the divine and beast. I have to physically run and talk to the chief to complete the quest. So it doesn't end once I beat the dungeon. It will end once I talk to the chief. Okay, now I just have to beat the boss. How close are you to finishing? How long would you say? Uh, I'm doing pretty good overall. Yeah? How about you? Mid, I'm like, I'm okay. I'm pretty nervous. No, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, uh, it's, I feel like you, you, if, if we are doing the same thing, you, you may have got a head start because I did not focus on those things when I was playing the game. Like, I don't know if you're about to beat it, like beat something right now. And you're like trying to like mind game me by like, getting me like, oh yeah, I can get this, and now you're about to snipe me last second. Like, I have no idea. Beat it. Interesting. Beat it. Uh, I mean, collect it. <clears throat> I just need to go and talk now to the bird, pick up the bow, and I can click on it. I think you might be playing mind games with me at this point. I, I don't know. <laughs> I think that may have been a deliberate slip up. Um, well, Highland I'm done. D. Woof! GG. Man, I have all of the ingredients. I have all the ingredients for upgrade all runes, and I am in the wind blight fight. Really? Oh my I am god. In the I'm on phase two. Oh my god. <laughs> and then I had the fairy fountain open with a warp right beside it, all the stuff. Man, that was close. That was a fun race. Honestly, we should schedule at some point a third one as like a best of three kind of deal, because now it's a one one. Alright, that's fine. We'll we'll do another day. We'll do a best two out of three. Sounds for all good. The marbles. Yeah, exactly. Have a, have a good evening. You too, man. Bye bye. All right. Bye bye.